Hello YouTube. Um I'm making this video off the whim right now. I'm recording it after a long Facebook live session of laughter and funnessness, but yeah, in this video you're simply gonna watch me do a portrait. Well, a bad portrait. And I don't know. This is my first time doing a traditional one that go on YouTube. I think maybe it has to be. I don't remember. My channel wasn't open. I make this in um, Movie Maker on Windows. Um, yeah, and there are a lot of jumps because the phone crashed a few times. And I'm sorry if you have epilepsy or something. There's gonna be a lot of shaking because I'm using it on a desk stand because I didn't want to make a makeshift one, so I wanted to purchase one from Commission Money. So yeah, um, yeah, I didn't want to. I did not want to, um, what's it called? Ah, use my words and stuff. Shit. Um, you know, I... I don't know. Basically, uh, it's been a pretty semi-okay week. It's exam week. And because of that, I haven't been drawing very much. But while I'm talking right now, I'm drawing a picture for a watercolor painting I'm working on. So, yeah, I'm excited to... To sit down and actually do this. Uh, sketch for you all. I've always wanted to do a traditional one. Because digitally you get to move things around. Traditionally you're kind of not forced to stay with your mistakes, but you have to recognize them more. You know? And that's not a problem for me. Because I actually really like the feeling of being bound down so that I'm forced to do better. Um, yeah. I don't know what to say in this video. We have six minutes to talk. How are you all doing today? <laughs> Shoot. It's Saturday. You all should be enjoying a Saturday event, occasion, excursion, or whatever. Um, if I could find the, the ending, oh, the picture picture of this, I'll post it. I mean, I'll put it at the end of the video. But if not, you all just might watch a drawing. Um, I'm tired. It's one in the morning. So it was one Saturday morning, and I'm sketching for my life. Um, working really hard over here, but I hope you guys are safe and blessed. Um, nonetheless, I'm supposed to say that for the end, but I'm gonna say it now. Be blessed. Um, yeah, so what's going on? There's nothing changing on this channel yet. Um, I guess you talk about net neutrality. Uh, yeah, so I needed to edit over that part. I got rid of a whole section of narrative because I sounded stupid. Yeah, so we need to keep net neutrality. Um, if you don't know, I feel like it could be the end of the internet that we love so much. I'm not about to get it played. Instagram is how I make some money, and I need that to stay regular. More importantly, like YouTube. So let me give you a little bit of a rundown when it comes to net neutrality. Um, it forces ISP, ICPs, your internet, what's that? ICPs, a lot of paper, lower. ISPs, your internet service providers. It keeps them from... Um, he it makes it so they can't prioritize like different websites and we're looking at service like with Comcast and Netflix there was a situation where Netflix the service was moving real slow for the people that use Comcast and they basically had to go back and door and make a deal and their speed caught up and that was a situation that they had to handle so um yeah with net neutrality we need it just so we can have balance um you know your ICP your ISP could possibly force YouTube to be need to, to charge YouTube to you know even be played on their platform and we don't know whether or not YouTube would probably even pay to go up there and you know it, it, it can damage websites like no Facebook no Instagram no Twitter uh, maybe Bank of America and stuff like that some websites will get slowed down and get played you know the FCC or you know the government doesn't keep it we can really be we can really be SOL with this kind of stuff so it's very important you also need to understand with net neutrality, you know, things will get slowed down a lot. And, you know, like Comcast, like I said, the Netflix situation, you know, it can really slow things down or we're soft, cut them off. And as much as we, we take this for granted, we need to fight for it just so we can keep our right to do this stuff, you know. And I know I'm not a very big channel to be sitting down and having this conversation. I know I'm not going to reach a lot of people with this, but me saying it hopefully will be enough to make somebody go oh well yeah maybe i should you know do something but what you can do is contact your 
um, I want to say your senators or the people who represent your state or whatever um, with battleforthenet.com I'll link it into the description below I mean honestly we need to have this conversation because I know I just cannot have it the best way possible because I'm not that person to be like oh yeah by the way woo woo no I'm not but this in particular is very important I like making YouTube videos now before it was more mature but now I started making a love and a hobby of it so I love you guys and I thank you so please 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 call your service providers you know not you know I'm sorry your congress people and tell them that you want to keep net neutrality we need it just so we can be free I would hate to be bound and chained down by companies that already get money. Cox costs a, a amount already. I don't want to give them more money. So battleforthenet.com will be in the link in the description below. But you know, you need to do we need to do our best to fight with all our heart and our mind. So thank you guys. Love you guys so much. Stay up. Be blessed. And I hope you all have a great, great day.